I too would like to um, thank the RCFB for helping us keep the safety roads uh, uh, enclosed for us to do your work. I, um, a, a few years ago when we met at Quantum Polytechnic University and we were just introduced to uh, Kinder Morgan at that time and I had four words for them right away when I first met them. The first five minutes I met them, I, I told them I have four words for you that's gonna carry me right till the end of that pipeline. And those four words were... Oh. <laughs> 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 I didn't know how to say it. <laughs> Over my dead body. <laughs> so the pipeline itself, it goes right through my backyard and around right off of Quartet First Nation, McMillan Island on to Bray Island, across the slough and over onto the mainland here. A long time ago, before the highways were here, the Salmon River was flooded with people. 10,000 Kwantlans lived here. 10,000 Kwantlans. Every bend on that Salmon River is a place for a family to stay and do their business of trade. Every bend on that Salmon River has a family name to it. From Tawasin, Muskum, all the way up the valley, Kekate, Katsi, Coquitlam. And from the neighboring tribes up river, they would paddle down for days, they would come and we would trade. The Salmon River was our highway. It, that water, we drank from the water, we cooked that water, fed our babies. Portland Territory here, it's too bad the clouds are up, but our lands were marked from mountain peak to mountain peak. That was our territory. And for you to know, who you are, every person standing here today, especially the elders. You represent five generations of people. We're not standing here alone. You're standing here representing your five generations of people. And for us to know the difference between right and wrong have been carried from that first generation onwards. 10,000 years ago, we were here, we were living, and we planned to be here to time immemorial until the last sun rises. Our children have that right to be on this land and living freely with a good environment. It's their inherent right to the land the water, the air, the rain, the snow, the wind, the ground, and from what's in the ground that keeps us healthy. Because every day you have to eat, and every day that food comes from the land. Anything where there's a pipeline, there's better ways to do it, safer. But never, never, ever in the watersheds when it comes to the First Nation people. Our watersheds are slowly diminishing. Our watersheds were starting to lose the water. It's bad enough to have an oil spill near that water. Kinder Morgan. Kinder Morgan. They don't know these things. Kinder Morgan, they know money. Kinder Morgan, they know politicians. They know how to pay a politician. We don't, we don't do that. We stand for the truth and we stand for what's right for your children's children. Gotland First Nation here has a very very strong elders group and leadership. 
And we do believe that whenever issues arise that come to the environment, we'll be the first ones to come out with the drums, the knowledge, the anticipation, and shake your hand to all those who came from the Burnaby Mountain. There was a promise up in Burnaby Mountain that they would be here, and they're here. I can't extend my thank you enough to those who fight for our rights. And you don't even belong to Kwantlen, but you're here for us. What a beautiful world. And what a beautiful world you're making for the children. It makes our leadership stand strong. It makes us see the truth. And it gives us lots of time to show gratitude. It shows lots of time for us to say thank you. And lots and lots of time for us to get to know each other as the people of the country, the land, the people of the land fighting for the people of the water who also come from the people of the sky and from the people in the ground. You all have a direction to go in your life and I'm so glad you stopped here at Kwatlin today and extend your best wishes to the safety of the environment of the nations that surround all of us right across British Columbia. Because every inch of land in British Columbia is on First Nations territory. Believe that, because it's true. You're on Quantum territory that overlaps with Mass Creek Gatesy. And with that, someone cut me off. <laughs> I'm going to let. I'm going to turn this away, and um, I do believe we have a purpose today, and we need to fulfill this purpose with lots of safety. We need to fulfill our day so that when we go home, you can always know that we stand together, shoulder to shoulder. And, and from my family and the elders group in Kwantlen. I thank you all for being here and I wish you all a safe journey home when it's all finished. And I thank our drummers and those who are reporting to the media. We need you to report the truth. We need to report the truth because that's how British Columbians live. British Columbians know better than to live a lie. We need to always speak the truth, know the truth, and hold your grandchildren up, telling them they're in a safer environment. And with that, I wish you all a great day. All my relations, I just got to see you. Okay. Woo! 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 Woo!